Hi, everybody. It's Emily and Leslie back with you for Tuesdays at 2. We have missed you all so much, and we're so excited to be bringing you Tuesdays at 2 at home. Now, things have changed so much since we saw you last, right? Of course, your business operations have been impacted, but we hope you're doing well. Um, we truly hope you're still able to make it work. Um, maybe you pivoted to selling your products online. Um, maybe you're a restaurant doing takeout or delivery now. Um, mm -hmm. Perhaps your entire team is now working from home and you're working through that. So we really hope you're doing well and kind of making everything work in this new crazy world we're living in. That's right. Those things are awesome if you're able to do it. And so another big adjustment your business is most likely experiencing because of everything going on and those changes is how to communicate with customers. And one of the easiest and most effective ways now more than ever is to do that with social media. Yeah. As if we all were on Facebook and Instagram, right? <laughs> Enough, more than right? Ever. Now we're all on more it than ever. all the time. Right. And so a question we're getting asked a lot by all of you is how to speak to the coronavirus as a small business right now, right? Mm -hmm. Are you be talking about it? Um, how do you talk about it? How often do you talk about it? Is it okay to still talk about, you know, sales and promotions and things mm -hmm. you're doing? Right, so social media is the right platform for these things. So we put together the three ways to use social media right now in the time of coronavirus. All right, so our number one tip is, to keep your company or to keep your community updated with social media okay right so as all these changes we've just talked about you might have new business hours you might have products that are not only available online you might have takeout mm -hmm. hours that are different from day to day um you might have events that you were planning to host in your store or an event that you were planning and now you can maybe pivot that to be a virtual event social media channels are a great way to share these updates with your community and keep people in the know of what going on. I myself even had a local small business. I went to purchase some masks. By the time I went to, to purchase, they were sold out. And that small business reached out to me to let me know when they were back in stock and I was able to go and purchase right away. So that's just one wow. example. And it's easy, right? It's just, you know, easy. Yeah, that's awesome. Okay, the second thing is to make sure that you're responding to questions and comments on social media, okay? So be honest and as open as possible, right? Authenticity will always win out in these situations, right? Especially now. That's so, right. People want to know how to help you, how to support you. People are really coming together on social media to make sure we're supporting and helping our small businesses right now, right? Mm -hmm. So let them know what you're doing, right? They're all stuck inside. They're checking Facebook and Instagram. Let them know causes you're supporting or maybe something you're doing for your community and let them know how they can help and kind of jump on board with you. They would love to do that. That's right. All right, number three, pause. That's right. <laughs> Don't do anything. It's okay yeah. to pause if you are just trying to figure out if you're gonna survive right now. Marketing can yeah. wait, posting can wait, there are no hard and fast rules right now. Our best advice is to use and share on social media what feels best and most true for you and your yeah. business, right? Like your community is there for you and they're going mm -hmm. to be there for you and we're all in this together, okay? So yeah. those are our top three tips for using social media right now. We hope they help. Let us know in the comments uh, how you've been pivoting, if you've been using social media, how you've been using social media. We'd really love to know. We know there are other small businesses out there that would love to know as well. So we're happy to be back with you for Tuesdays at two and we'll see you next week and take care everybody. Bye.